Doctors say they are facing a new challenge as they send vaccine distribution into overdrive. We are talking about mountains of paperwork. News 2's Katie Turner joins us live in this studio after hearing from Low Country medical leaders about their struggles. And Katie, you walk through what goes into di distribution of just one dose of the vaccine and was surprised by what you learned. Yeah, Carolyn, I'm going to make this a little bit more visual here. So imagine this is one vaccine dose and here's some of the data that has to be documented every single time one is administered. And MUSC says they're doing this three to 4,000 times a day. The goal is simple. To get vaccines in arms. Behind the scenes, paperwork is causing a headache. Documenting every single administration of every single patient separately, in addition to everything else we do in vans. And that part is just extremely difficult and very time consuming. All vaccine providers in South Carolina have to enroll in the federal government's vaccine administration system, also known as VAMS. The system asks more than 25 questions for just one shot. On average, again, we're vaccinating between three and 4,000 patients a day, and it takes us at least a minute per patient. And so that really adds up to several full-time people sitting in cubicles just doing documentation of VAMS. On top of slowing down vaccinations, many believe VAMS is contributing to the lag in the CDC's data collection, which could be the reason why it looks like thousands of doses aren't being used. DEC officials say these numbers are expected as vaccine providers continue to work out the kinks. We share the desire to get it into as many arms as quickly as possible. And while we have hundreds of providers across the state, uh, they've just recently received the vaccine. And so they're having to put the systems in place to distribute it. MUSC says they are working with DHEC to streamline data collection by using their system, Simon, so they can reach their goal of vaccinating 10,000 people a day. The important piece is that we all have a shared vision for what we're trying to achieve, which is no extra work and to use Simon as our vaccine database. As for the latest distribution numbers, MUSC says they've received about 58,000 doses and given out nearly 63,000 doses, meaning they've given out more than they've received by squeezing out extra doses of the vaccine. For now in studio, I'm Katie Turner. Count on two. All right. Very interesting, Katie. Thank you.